100 billion naira has been spent on the Kanji hydropower power plant for rehabilitation and expansion in the past eight years. This was disclosed by Mainstream Energy, the custodian of the Kanji hydropower plant, at a sign-in ceremony for the capacity expansion of the plant, which is expected to generate an additional 280 megawatts to the national grid. Correspondent Habida Lawa has details. The Kainji plant was commissioned as Nigeria's first hydropower plant in 1968 and Jeba plant came up in 1985. The two Jenkos are under a concession management of Mainstream Energy Solutions, who took over the plant in 2013 after the privatization exercise. Now a capacity recovery is being undertaken and when completed, the plant will generate additional 192.8 megawatt to the national grid. The generation company is faced with its own peculiar challenges and is asking for a special foreign exchange allocation for the power sector. This is because most equipment required for rehabilitation and installation has still been produced outside the country. When we took over this company, one dollar was 156 or 167 naira. Today, one dollar, I leave you to guess. The one thing, the waiting period before accessing foreign exchange. Sometimes we have to wait very long before we get foreign exchange to buy our spare parts. And that costs a lot of money and time. It's evident that mainstream solutions have consistently shown this sort of commitment and capacity improving in improving this uh, generation uh, in the Nigerian electricity supply industry. Electrification agency. This collaboration with Power China is in line with the federal government concession agreement to recover the combined installation capacity of 1,338.4 megawatts. This is aimed at improving power distribution to Nigerians. It should remain to lead the project team to ensure that the project is delivered following the terms of the contract. Respect our commitment to ministry Energy Solutions Limited and ensure that Power Channel Hadong fulfills its social responsibilities in Nigeria. We refer or reference mainstream as the poster boy of the success story of the privatization of the power sector. Recently, the National Council on Privatization conducted a performance uh, review uh, in line with the performance agreement executed with mainstream. The process for the rehabilitations of the 1G10 and 1G8, 160 megawatts will commence with a view to completing recovery of all the units by the end of 2026. Energy experts here believe addressing the critical challenges will go a long way in providing an enabling environment for the Nigerian electricity supply industry. Habida Lawal, TVC News, Abuja.